Yeah, I have a bunch of that. I am professional at crafting. So. Boom, bam, craft master. Look at that wolf over there. Hey, you attack that wolf. <clears throat> oh, hell no, man. This wolf can't get to me. I'm oh, shit, it can. Oh, Why? shit. Dude, just Dude. keep fleeing. Dude, get out of here, it. man. Go across the border to the other side so it's not so. You boys like me, go! And. I'm jumping. Ah. Oh, my eyes. Oh, <laughs> you didn't die as tough as I thought you would. Yeah, it only just, it's only a little bit, but I'm in Weavers. Okay, I'm almost there. Where are you? Oh, you're right there. Uh. <laughs> Put my blade. The blade. <laughs> you, have, you have braids? Yes, so. Uh, red Looks beard. Like you have braids. You have like a skull thing. Got a unicorn horn. Oh, Except my trade. My bad. <laughs> oh. Okay. Let's just keep going straight. Let's keep going west. Since I guess when you're gaming, you have to use terms like east and west and north. And east and west. Bogey nine o'clock. Three forty-five. Farming. This wolf looks like it's taking a dump. Let me see. Oh man, you slaughtered it. Remember when Daddy used to always play pranks? And so, uh. He. A bungee cord snapped him in the elbow, and he came inside, and he's like, Oh, my elbow! That <laughs> mom was like, Stop playing around! <laughs> he's like being pissed at him when he's actually like in severe pain. <laughs> Uh, the best one is mom told me that when they were when we were at the house the house that we uh, lived in until we were 13 that was 550 square feet yeah. <laughs> um, she said that dad fell and hit his head on the doorknob and knocked himself out he was unconscious and she thought he was playing so she's like stop it and she was kicking him <laughs> when he was on the ground when he was actually unconscious <laughs> <laughs> Even if he died, she's kicking uh, his lifeless body. Stop it, clap. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's funny. I you I do remember play, that. That's you play pranks so many times, people don't believe you anymore. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, but before he hid under when she was a cop, he hid underneath your crib, and then when she came home, he reached out and grabbed her leg, and he's like, ah. Yeah. She had a gun. She would have shot at that. <laughs> Crazy ass man. Extra long daddy. That's what this person's name is. But they still don't believe, man. Like I can't believe how many times you almost set the house on fire. Nah. <laughs> Babe, which times do you remember? Cause I have this one time in mind. Oh. I. I don't know. Like. Like. You. Taking all the fireworks. And opening them and just pouring the powder on the ground <laughs> and lighting the powder and then having a gust of wind come up and blow the lit powder underneath the deck <laughs> and just uh, yes. underneath the deck is full of leaves and debris and just gosh and having to grab a hose and like put it out real quick oh man that's so funny. Because the one I remember was like, I was in the backyard and I had this huge green bowl and um, like salad bowl or whatever. So I filled it full of water and then I had this other small bowl and I put it in there and filled it full of gasoline. And then I lit it on fire. And I was like, well, if it gets out of control, I can just tip the small bowl in the water no big deal right <laughs> with the gasoline yeah <laughs> so put it out water you know whatever <laughs> and... where do you need to go now oh let's see uh... Uh, like yeah just if you stay over here on the road then 
<clears throat> um. Oh yeah. So I light it on fire, right? And the neighbor looks over and sees me, and I was like, "Oh crap!" Neighbor caught me. So I go to try to tip the bowl in the gasoline, and then I didn't know it floated on top of water. So I was trying to like, the whole top of the thing's on fire right now. So the whole bowl's on fire, and I was like, "Oh crap!" And then put it out, and then I try to tip it over, and then the bowl tips over and goes underneath the porch. And full all the leaves. <laughs> and then, so, it's fire underneath the damn porch again. <laughs> and then run out there with a the hose putting it out. <laughs> that porch was my worst I enemy. Wonder, I wonder what point they decided to put that fence up underneath the porch, because... It made it really difficult for me to put out my fires, man. <laughs> uh, because so many times... What are you doing down there? Oh man, I got so lucky. Mm. So many times, the underneath of the porch has almost got on fire. Yeah, man, that's just the porch. I can't even recall what I did in the house. I remember a couple times lighting fireworks on top of the railing. It's almost like cocaine lines, you know, but with fireworks. Well, you used to put foil on metal poles in the backyard before we'd have a lightning storm. <laughs> I didn't know you knew that. <laughs> of course I freaking knew that. I watched you do it. <laughs> no freaking way. <laughs> they let me. <laughs> okay, I don't think they let you. I just think they didn't. <laughs> yeah, man. They just were not aware <laughs> of what is going on. I was an animal, bro. <laughs> Dude, our parents worked a lot. Okay. <laughs> That's so funny. Dude, I was thinking poop stories. Oh, God. Like Macy and <laughs> the hamster. It didn't poop, but it still died. <laughs> hamster is just unfortunate. It was just an unfortunate. That sucked, man. I'll tell you what, when you leave a hamster out in the sun, you come back, it's stiff as a board. Uh, I don't remember it. I just remember it being like in its little tube. It was in a tube? Just dead. Yeah, like, uh, where are you? I remember just laying outside on its, you know, on its side, like all Got dead and stuff. Chesties in here. <laughs> um. I just remember it being in its little plastic tube, just dead. And then mom just being pissed. <laughs> um, there was that one time, dad was working on her bathroom or whatever, and then we had Macy, and uh, so me and dad were pooping in a Folgers can downstairs. I thought it was a five gallon bucket, but yes, continue. <laughs> Either way, five gallon bucket actually makes more sense. But you can sit on it. But I swear, the whole I don't know. thing was the lid on the Folgers can. Anyway, I, I could be wrong. I could be wrong. Either one. <laughs> so. Either one's disgusting. Were you, were you participating in that? No, I was not pooping in the can. I okay. went to the neighbor's house that lived across the street. The teacher. Ah. I pooped at her house. Ah. Okay. Okay. Oh yeah. 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 I do remember that. <laughs> so. Yeah, Dad and I, yeah, we're pooping in there, and then, uh, we're hanging out downstairs. I don't know what we're doing, we were watching, like, King of the Hill, or watching a movie or something like that. Mom was downstairs. And, we're hanging out down there, and then Macy starts licking Mom, and she's like, Oh, Macy, gosh, your breast smells like poop. <laughs> Dad and I just look at each other, and we're like, uh, Oh, oh bear! <laughs> Yes. So when Dad tells that story, he says, "Macy, your breath smells like crap." <laughs> and he does it like super exaggerated. That's funny. Now I I feel like, you know, I I'm not a uh, not real great at knowing when certain stories are acceptable and when they're not. <laughs> um, oh, go this way, come. Uh, I told that story to someone at work, and uh, I feel like everyone was real freaked out by it. <laughs> For real? For our, my German Shepherd. 
my roommate's husky. And I was like, Maya keeps eating Trigger's poop. They're like, no, she doesn't. I'm just like, no, like straight out of his ass. Oh shit, those things are scary. Ah! Woo, man, get hell no. Yeah, I will stand back here and throw my axe. Oh my gosh, I'm dying. <laughs> <laughs> oh. God. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's oh, here. shit. Crap, let's get out of here, man. Man, I forgot what I was even saying. Oh, uh, man. No. Oh, shit, Death Wolf. Oh, shit. I feel like, oh, I should have just stayed on the road. Oh, hey, no, you skelly. There it is, skelly. Ah, skelly! Dude, stop Sorry. yelling. <laughs> skelly over there. Ooh, look at all those shiny balls up there. <laughs> Don't die, bro. Two, oh, we're good. I got two, I two skellies in my ass. Drink some potion, no big deal. I'm gonna get these shiny balls. Shiny about. Oh, hey, you're right there. Mm. Ooh, that's a bear. Oh, where? You wanna watch me smang this bear? Yeah, dude, freaking smack it. Right in the oh butt. My <laughs> God. Right in the butthole. How do you like that, bear? Huh? huh? Yeah. How do you like oh. that? Ooh, I gotta get all these shiny things over here. Ooh, you see that Yeti? There's a Yeti in there, you see it? Yeti? No, oh, there's a Yeti in there, bro. Dude, I wanna in see that cave. Ooh. Whoa. Isn't that cool? Yeah. Dang, baby. Is that baby Yeti? No, I don't know what those things are. They're like some kind of... I don't know. Well, I ain't going in there. Mm -mm. Like, there's so many things that you did in your childhood that are the definition of your name. <laughs> it's... I don't Dude, know if... my wall of dad, monsters. I don't know if mom and dad named you Kyle and that made you the way you are, or if they just knew you were gonna be the way you are and they named you Kyle, you know? I don't know, yeah. It cursed like, me though, somehow. Oh like, God. I don't know anybody else that would spray axe onto a fire. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fire the monsters. The Mon wall of monsters. Dude, remember when I, dad first let me start his vehicle? And so I, I uh, pushed the gas in the clutch and all the way, and then uh, threw it in first when it was supposed to be reverse, <laughs> and just let the clutch go with the gas floor. <laughs> I do not. What? Yo. Yeah. So Dad, like, he's like, "Hey, man, I trust you enough to go start my vehicle." <laughs> High five. So the Mazda parked behind the high five. And then there was a drop off in the backyard of like, what, four feet, five feet to the neighbor's yard? There's a pure, like, just drop off fence. I don't know, I, just, I thought that's how you did it. I, Dad didn't ever teach me how to have a clutch, I don't think, before then. Yeah, you just let it out slow, no big deal. <laughs> or maybe I was just supposed to put it in neutral and turn the key. And just push the clutch. I don't know, man. There was a lot that he information that he gave me. I couldn't freaking translate it. I was in fifth grade. <laughs> it's like Chinese. <laughs> Yo, man, in school. So in one of our buildings, we used to have those bathtub sinks with like three faucets, like a big sink. And top floor and bottom floor of the men's bathroom. So, I used to just put a piece of toilet paper in there, and I used to just turn all three of the faucets on and walk out. <laughs> just thinking you know, what I, you know <laughs> what I don't remember ever in school is pooping. Really? Did we poop? Did I poop in the high school bathroom? Dude, all I don't, the I don't remember ever going in there. I had to go to the bathroom at some point. Where did I poop? I don't know, man. <laughs> I was pooping all the time, man. I don't remember pooping poop in high school. City. <laughs> I remember I'm going projected. to my f no. <laughs> I remember going. I 
have to wait for this bear. I remember going to my friend's house in high school and doing sleepovers and having to drink a bunch of water because I ate so much candy I had terrible gas. <laughs> and I'd have to drink a bunch of water just so I had an excuse to keep going to the bathroom to fart. <laughs> Dude, I used to steal on dates, man. Before I knew how I was lactose. Well, before when I was lactose intolerant. Yeah, man. I have to wait for the spare. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, I used to like, I remember going to movie theaters and like, uh, like sitting down eating popcorn and then just being like, hey, uh, I gotta go to the bathroom or whatever. Just because like I'm sitting there and my fart is so built up and I'm quenching it and it's, I'm trying not to let it slip so I don't know if it stinks or not. <laughs> so like you're holding it and holding it and you're like, oh my gosh, it's gonna go. Then you stand up and by the time you get outside, you don't have to fart anymore and you're like, son of a bitch. Yeah, that's the worst. And Sometimes then, just gosh. go ahead, sorry. Oh well, yeah. And then you go sit back down next to her, and then it happens again, and then you eventually just let it slip, man. I used to start farting, man. I love like, it. Oh yeah, me too. I have a <laughs> bowel disease. I have an excuse. I do whatever I want. So this is what you. This is my method, okay? So you get out of here. Get out of here. This is my bear. Get out of here. This dick. Chase you already him out. skinned the bear. Okay, so. My method is you go, that happens. You have to fart and then it goes away. You go into the bathroom, sit on the toilet, and you just massage your abdomen. Like literally, just rub your hands over the area where it's like <laughs> trapped and just massage it out. <laughs> you know, it makes sense. It, it makes sense. It works. You go with, you know how your insides are shaped, how they go like up, across, and down. So you literally just go up, across, and down. You just sit here and you just kind of rub it in a circle and you just push it out. Push it out. Success rate, 75%. 75%? That's good. That's it's good. It's pretty good. I feel like it's pretty good. That's you know? better than anything. See, my ex's mom told me to go upside down on the wall. Stick my ass up in there. Okay, there's also a yoga pose you can do, which also has a very... I, I'm, you know, I am a professional in gas, okay? Call it. Okay, let's hear it. Let's hear it. Gas. Oh, my gosh. So you yes. just lay, just lay on your back on the floor lay on your back and just tuck one knee towards your chest and then switch and then do it again and just keep switching uh, just move stuff around i wish my guy could do it right now but dude that's i know exactly what you're talking about yeah i do it like at the gym all the time but my back pops and i do it to pop my back <laughs> Shit, man. sharing deodorant man that's so funny like i never even thought that was like not a normal thing are you still recording? Yeah, just to gameplay. Oh. Yeah, I mean, I think mom maybe thought it was normal, and then she posted something on, like, Facebook. <laughs> like, like a poll, like, hey. And then people are like, uh, no. <laughs> yeah, dude, I used to get so pissed at you when you would use my toothbrush. Oh, I yeah, that was me. Because <laughs> you were the only one who would use my toothbrush. Oh, my toothbrush shit. would be wet. Did you just I, jump off? Yeah, by accident. Dude, it's pretty high. I'm so mad when you use my toothbrush. <laughs> like, ah. I'm kind of an animal now I think about it. Like, I really don't. It's just like, ah, whatever. I'll just wash it off. <laughs> Nasty, bro. Did I tell you about the... Oh, my gosh. I haven't told you about this. You're going you're gonna to think this is pretty disgusting. Probably. Yeah. So this one time in the fire department, um, I just needed to do my... I seen it to jerk my yerk, and then I did, Yuck. and then oh god, <laughs> I didn't have anything to go in. So I was like, oh crap, uh, man, this is not a really good story. <laughs> anyway, okay, so I was like, oh crap, like so I'm gonna use my PT shirt. So I want my PT shirt, no big deal. So I was gonna wash it. Oh god. And then the next day, this guy knocks on my door really early in, the, early in the morning. He's like, hey man, I don't have a PT shirt. Can I borrow yours? And I was like, oh yeah, sure man. <laughs> like, oh, it's early. God. And so he wears it. And then I'm the next day I'm just like, oh no. So I'm just like, oh crap, dude. I just like jizz in that shirt and he just wore it to sports day, so he was sweating that thing all day. And then he gives it back to uh, me all folded. Why? Uh, <laughs> disgusting. So I waited a year. And then I was like, uh, and then I just told everyone about it. <laughs> and I was like, it'll make its way around to him. And so I waited and then about a year later it made it's made its way back to him. 
And he's like, hey man, did you do that? I was like, I was like yeah, dude. I honestly. Like, not on purpose. Yeah, I was like, it wasn't on purpose, man. I, I just forgot that I just done my shirt. <laughs> and uh, like a year ago, I messaged him. He's a cop now. And I was like, hey man, remember that one time I just knew shirt you wore it all day? <laughs> Uh, oh, man. How did he not notice that the shirt was not clean? That's what I want to know. I, I think it was on the back. I mean, it was on the. Well, he had the belly too, so. Yeah, I'm almost dead. Oh, no. <laughs> Just casually. Yeah, I'm almost dead. Oh, <laughs> I got shot in the back. Yeah. I don't know if I share that one. Where are you? Uh, I'm at the bottom. They're like behind me or something. Yeah, me at the bottom. Yeah, I gotta download this fucking. Oh, I should probably in here. Gotta download hmm. the footage. Actually, I should probably get off where uh, the fucking sun goes away. Yeah, that's cool. I'm, I'll get off and uh, I'm just gonna fast travel somewhere. I'm gonna go work out. Alright. Well, hey, this is good. Thanks. Um, yeah, appreciate it. Yeah, I, mean, I feel like I didn't really do anything. It was well, like, it was hard to um, get into like a groove, you know? Like, it takes a while. Yeah, yeah, it, it takes. Oh, my mic's over here. <clears throat> yeah, it, it for real does, especially when you're not really in the mood and you don't have anything to talk about. Especially when you don't have anything you're excited to talk about. Like, there's no. Yeah. You know, premise pan it. So yeah, no, I think um, I was really struggling Monday and today it's just like uh, so. Yeah. I mean, I got some. I think it's gonna be good. Um, especially some of the catching the houses on fire stories, the Kyle. You know. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Hopefully you can use some of that. Yeah, definitely for sure. Cause it was like natural. Flow. Yeah, well, that's what it takes a hard time to do. Yeah, natural, like, because everything. But I guess the other thing, too, is even if we talked for like two hours and it was really all over the place, like, you can edit and cut. And. Yeah. Oh, so. Yeah, it's. Fish out, fish out. All right, cool beans. All right. Well, I will Gonna catch. Gonna go work out. And... Sounds good. Go I up. will. You're just gonna get off on a rock? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Alrighty. Alright, catch you later. Okay, bye. Bye.